white and shuffles across the floor, come dancing. Had to get Ooh. it in there. Oh. and a very warm welcome. We are the Highwaymen. I'm Steve and that handsome young man over there is Jason. What are we talking about today, Steve? Well, mate, you know what? We're going to talk about something very close to the nation's heart. Strictly, bit of Strictly come dancing. You know, and, and do you know, you and I have been friends for many, many <laughs> years, Jay, and, and our tastes are very similar. I can't believe the revelation that you dropped on me that you don't even watch it. Never seen it. I can't it. believe you. I mean, I've seen What's clips of it. I've seen bits of it. I even tried to watch a little bit of it earlier um, just to get the gist, but no, it was not my bag. So well, tell us. Because it brings joy, joy to people. You see? Maybe. It makes them happy, isn't it? It might go against the grain a bit. I don't, I don't know. Absolutely. Absolutely, mate. Tell us what you're thinking. I know that. Well, I, I know that they have it in the States and I know that they have it. It's, it's a huge, it's a huge phenomenon. But anybody like yourself that hasn't seen it, the basic idea is this stems from years ago, in fact, from the 1950s, I think. Uh, the BBC used, used to put something on uh, called Come Dancing. Uh, yeah. What's white and shuffles across the floor? Come Dancing. Had to get Ooh, it in there. I'll, uh, I'll, I'll have that one. <laughs> I normally, hey, have, to send, I I normally have to send... I normally have to censor his jokes out. <clears throat> Go on. <laughs> So, so anyway, um, it did prove to be a big, a, a big success for decades. Quite frankly, it fell out of favour. Uh, I would say in the nineties, something like that. Uh, and so they, they kind of like they reinvented it. So they reinvented it as a strictly come dancing, uh, and then they started to, to drop in celebrities. So they would take a celebrity who couldn't dance, uh, and they would then teach them with a uh, professional dancer. And they would compete against other celebrities. So, and, and it was a knockout thing. The public vote for it, very similar to X Factor, uh, very similar to I'm a celebrity, get me out of here, all that, that type of affair. It's the same sort of format where the public vote for who they want to get rid of or who they want to keep. There are judges um, who, are, who are stars in their own right, quite frankly. So there, there are judges and they score them at the end of every dance and there is a leaderboard. But that's really just a, a guide, really. It is the public who decide who, who comes and who stays. The reason I love Strictly so much is it honestly brings such joy. It just brings joy. Even if you're not into that kind of thing, you can't help but get sucked into the atmosphere, even though it's on the TV. Uh, and and they, they have real key weeks as well. Sucked in. What's Sorry. wrong with you? Sucked into the atmosphere. You... Go on. <laughs> my ch my childish mind. My childish mind. Go on. I was getting sucked in. No, I was getting sucked off. Sorry, that's something different. Different show. But, but you can't help. You can't help yourself, can you? You, you, you no. Here we are having a lovely chat with the nation about one of the most joyous things on television, and you have to bring in fellatio. Yeah. Right? You, you really need to go and have a bit of a word with yourself, really. Or go on, Steve. Yourself, one of the two. <clears throat> what and do you anyhow, think? So they have key weeks. They have key weeks. These are really good. So they have movie weeks. So, so that's where they'll take a theme from a famous movie and they'll probably get into character with that. And there's all different types of dancing. They do ballroom dancing. They do Charleston. They, they do... They, and now there's even the modern dancing, you know, that, that goes street dancing that's in mm -hmm. there as well. And, and they get judged on that. It's, if you've not seen it, you need to see it. The last series is just literally yesterday finished. And uh, and the most wonderful bloke won it called Hamza. Um, I think Fleur should have won it myself, but that's just my, my personal opinion. Uh, and uh, what an amazing, overwhelming reaction that these people have when they win. They're, they are genuinely joyous and happy about the whole thing and it's really interesting because you watch them at the beginning of it i mean this thing starts um in sort of late september i think it's and it runs right up to just before christmas and you watch watching people go in and you think oh my word look at this like 20 odd stone or something like that and they end it if they go all the way through they end it at a live 11 stone leaping around like like a 
I need, I, I need, I to, go, I need to go in. in. You've got Jimmy Elliott or Billy Elliott. Billy Elliott. And it's, it's brilliant. It's brilliant. Well, that's my opinion anyway. I think if you like Strictly, everybody, give us a thumbs up, give us a subscribe. So we, we, we're going against Jason the Grinch here, the Strictly Grinch. However, you did start this video saying you felt it was fixed. Got to be honest. There is... So much scandals going on. I, I'm so cynical. I am so cynical. So, yes. How do we know? How do we know if the votes are real? How do we know if those phone calls have actually come in? And how are they verified? How are they How are they adjudicated? I think, oh, that was a please for Hamza. And I'm, I'm pleased he won. Let's just get that out there. Fleur was a better dancer. And it's she, more about popularity as well. Now, I, I also, now because I, obviously we were talking about yesterday, I did have a look at a little clip, and somebody said she actually tripped and fell, but it was cut out. So the, the people at home right. didn't, didn't actually get to see that, and she fell over and, and it was cut out. Not quite true. They are live shows, and yeah. she, they, they, she did make a mistake. And this, right, so they're referring to a dance off. Okay. So what happens is when the public vote, um, it will come down to two couples. And then those two couples have to dance again in front of the judges. And the judges will decide which one of them they want to keep and which one of them they want to get rid of. And it came down to Will. Uh, it was Will and Fleur. Uh, and uh, Will was quite a popular guy as well. Yeah. I can't remember his last name. Mellor, I think it might be. Will Mellor, yeah, I know you mean. I know you mean, yeah, Will Mellor, yeah. And uh, two uh, two pints of lager and a packet of crisps, please. Is that is that I've right? seen I've seen one of the things. I don't, I don't know. He's been in a few things. Right. Okay. So um. So so anyhow, um, on the dance off itself, Will did do a better dance. He did, right. and, and and it was absolutely perfect. And Fleur did make a mistake. Now I suppose in reality, if the judges were judging it just on that dance and that dance alone then he should have gone through. So there is an element of fix in there. Well, I'm convinced there is, to be honest with you. Yeah. And, uh, and the odds, because you can bet on this thing, the odds on Hamza plummeted a few weeks ago, right down to, I think he ended on two to five. So in other words, if you put five quid on, you only got your five quid back yeah. plus another two pounds. Right, right. So, so, you know, that, that, that's, so I honestly think that, well, do you know what? Well, it's brilliant and I love it and I wouldn't miss it. I've got to be honest with you. It, 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 it does cheer you up. I do think like everything on the TV at this moment in time with things like that, it is rigged. I'd love so to what, prove me wrong. So what I, do you think, people, if you're viewing this, if this is something you watch, do you believe it's rigged or do you think it's, it's a bit of truth and honesty? Let us know in the comments, please. And don't forget to like and subscribe to this video and hit the bell icon as well. So you get notified when we get out a new video, put out a new video. And it's free. It's even free. Best value on the internet. It. Best value on the internet. I can't believe it. Anything more to add to that one, Stephen? No, I don't think so. I, I, I would love to hear from other people what they think about it. Uh, as I say, I don't want this to detract at all from the mm. wonderful program that it is. But, you know, I do look at it and I do think, uh, do you know what? Is it? Now, there's also, oh, just very quickly, there's also a rubbish dancer in there. An absolute rubbish one. Always is every single season. And for some miraculous way, they stay in longer and longer than they really should have done. So you get good dancers go. So it all builds up to be a bit of a scandal and, and, and a bit of controversy, which, of course, makes people watch it more. Of course. So, Incidentally, uh, a few years ago, I did used to get told I looked like one of the dancers, and I got told it about five times by different people. It was quite a long time ago now, and I can't remember the name of the guy. It'll come to me, and I'll remind you when Kevin? I remember. Kevin. Kevin the gerbil. Kevin? <laughs> it's a Russian, a Russian, <laughs> a Russian fella. Kevin. There can't be a dancer called Kevin, surely. They're all exotic names, like <laughs> Pablo and Fabio. No, there, are, there are a couple of British people in there as well. Oh, okay, Some called Kevin. Enough. Called Kevin. Yeah, there's one called Kevin. I'm going to Google Kevin Kevin on Strictly and see if I look like him. Anyway, if Steve's got nothing all else right. to add, we'll draw that to a close here. Thank you very much for watching. Tune in, subscribe, and we'll see you all next time. 
And Stephen will bring Good his to tap see dance. Everybody. Steve's going to bring his tap dance shoe and shoes and do a little dance for us. My left foot always been better than the right one. My left foot always gets me where I need to go. I'll start out easy. A little more complex. We've got to get in hold, you see, Jay. A little bit of a... Good man. A, yes, we're all there. Remember, keep dancing. Thanks for watching. Bye. See you later.